tonight we are getting ready for the big game and we've already seen some epic tailgates so far with George Oliphant getting down and dirty with the Buffalo Bills but now it's my turn to get in on the action. Raiders! After only minutes of hanging out with Raider Nation one thing is clear Oakland knows how to tailgate. This is like a black and silver Mardi Gras. It's off the hunt. I support my Raiders. These are my boys. I represent them. We kind of take great pride in the fact that we throw the best tailgate party in the NFL. And along with the elaborate outfits and spirited fanfare is a tailgate that has been dubbed one of the baddest barbecues in Football Nation. I'm Kingsford Kirk, head of the Bad Boys of Barbecue. Welcome to the greatest show on the blacktop. The Bad Boys of Barbecue have made a name for themselves by feeding hungry fans some of the tastiest game day eats around. Kirk, this is the best tailgate setup I've ever seen. What made you guys want to go to the extreme with such an elaborate spread? It just started small like any other party does and it just grew year by year, got bigger and bigger and now we're where everybody wants to come party. Cheers, my friend. It's game day, it's going to get hectic, so I'm here to help you. One look around and you can see this is some gourmet barbecue. Today we have fresh oysters. We got about 240 of them. We've got fresh salmon we're gonna grill. We've got pulled pork, 80 pounds of marinated chicken, tri-tip. We've got ribs in the smoker right now. There's about 18 racks. For a party like today, we probably have about 400 pounds of meat. That's good eating right there. Everything that we cook has a different type of flavor. What kind of chicken is this? this it's is a soy. Soy ginger, it's a Hawaiian ginger. type flavor. Oh, I thought it's delicious. So how do you get this chicken so tender? Well, they're marinated for like 24 hours uh -huh. in, a, in a teriyaki soy sauce. Oh, nice. Uh, mixture. It just falls apart. It's so tender. This is legit. Best thing here, chicken. And oysters. All right, so I see there's a bunch of oysters on the grill. I've only had them raw. Can you just pop them on there and grill them? Just put them on the grill, wait till they open up just slightly, and then crack them from the back, put them in the garlic and butter. And when they spit like that, that means they're happy. I think they want out of their shell. Yeah, they want out real bad. Let's do this before another pop. Push it in and then fry up. There you go. OK, you got, got it. it. Oh, got it. Now over the top. Over the top. Take the top lid off. Oh, I there did you it. go. I'd love to try one of those oysters. Well, let's take a skewer. Yeah, let's try these a little bit. They're in a fresh garlic butter. Oh, these are big ones. Cheers. Cheers. Welcome to the bad boys. Oh my god, those are so good. If you want to tailgate, this is how you do it. The two things that everybody comes for is a tri-tip and a grilled oyster. And I don't know why, but you can't get tri-tip on the East Coast. So everybody from the East Coast, really? Hey, you got tri-tip today? We always have tri-tip. Tri-tip. We're about to unveil our uh, famous tri-tip here, yes. and it's been marinating in a wow. in marinade for that. about two and a half days. Oh yeah. So what we're gonna have, to have you do is slice it. Okay. Oh, this uh, is so tender. Yeah, it's oh like God. butter, isn't it? Oh, uh, this just slices so nice. Look at that. Okay, I gotta try a piece. I oh can't gosh. handle it anymore. <laughs> Let's do this. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Mm -hmm. That is so juicy. I don't know what flavors. It's kind of sweet, citrusy almost. That is good. That is really good. That's what makes us the number one tailgate in the NFL. Our food is the best. Who's going to win the game today? No matter what team you cheer for, one thing is for sure. Wherever you find football fans, there is great food not far behind. Yeah!